Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Pride Plays. Today, our new series, we will be playing uh, Blair Witch. Now, I've played this game before. I didn't beat it. I don't even know how far I got. I remember it not being that scary, but scary enough for me to play. Oh, I was going to read that. Something about... I think it means if I'm a dick in the game, I get a shitty ending. Anyway, new game. Let's, let's just get this party started. There's no need thinking about it. Uh, excuse me. Let's just get rolling here. I got the lights off. The headphones turned up high. I'm hoping to get some good spooks. But we'll see what happens. Because, you know, you never know. And because it's almost that time of the year where spooks are in uh, style. I figure let's get started. This isn't the one I'm looking forward to for good content, though. I got another one lined up. Uh, it's called Home Sweet Home. And I did play that one before. And that one terrified me. That one was a very scary game. Not this one, though. This one's just kind of scary, if I remember correctly. But, you know what? It would probably be good, wholesome content. Look at that. Look at that dog in the passenger seat. He's going to be our buddy during this game, and I'm not just pulling your leg. Uh, it's actually, I think I remember it being kind of annoying. But uh, I'm waiting for them to pick up here and tell the story of what's going on. Um, I haven't seen the movie Blair Witch. I might have seen it like once, but like I was probably half paying attention. All right, hang on. What about pants? Shoes. This marks the latest in a series of disappearances dating back to 1994 when a group of students ventured into the woods near Burkittsville, never to be seen again. How many students? That's not good reporting. That only gives me like some details. You know, they made a bunch of those shirts and those hats. The chances that there's another kid wearing them, they're not very high, but they're high enough to consider. Oh, am I driving? No, okay. Good, because I'm not holding my controller at the moment. Yep, you get phone calls. Tap. Oh, other one. Uh, I'd like to reject, but I kind of want to get the good, uh, the good ending. It's, uh, it's good to hear from you. I, I didn't think you'd call. Yeah, well, neither did I. I'm pretty sure this is my ex. So what are you up to? I didn't even know what I'm up to. Just calling to check in. I'm joining the search. Why wouldn't it be? Why wouldn't it be? You know why? You know what? Never mind. Never mind. Right. Maybe I shouldn't have called. You shouldn't have. No, Jess, wait, wait, wait. No, I, 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 I'm glad you did. Listen, I'm almost there. I'll, I'll call you. <laughs> right. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, bye. Ah, <laughs> uh, got him. Do you hear that, boy? I got her good. Oh, that's it? They just wanted me to answer the phone while I'm driving? It's kind of annoying, but okay. Anyway, we're driving. Uh, it hasn't been explained why that's not a good idea. And uh, I don't I don't want to get ahead of the game here. I want the game to tell the story, then I can just, you know, make fun of the story. That's what I do, but, you know. We'll be patient. We'll wait until then. I'll tell you what, though. That guy's got a nice truck. With no license plate, that's illegal. It's very illegal, sir. Are you gonna go search for a kid? I think we'd be better off trying to avoid the police until uh, we get a proper license plate on there. We're gonna get pulled over. Truck's gonna get towed. And how are we gonna search for the kid? Even if we find him, what are we gonna do? Walk him home? We're gonna give him a piggyback ride the whole way? Uh, I don't think so. Look at I think I just saw a bottle of bourbon. Come on, boy. He's fucking so drunk. Find a way to contact Sheriff Lanning. That's why it's not a good idea for me out here. Cause this dude's fucking blitzed. Is he gonna explain the dog? Oh, I can customize the dog. Kind of want to make this dog just scary. Okay, so let's go. Uh, uh make him scary. Let me go with the green eyes. They glow the most. 
red collar. Uh, uh, we go with the darkest fur. I, I want the dog to be like coming at me in the woods, and I shit my pants, and I realize it's my dog, and I'm like, oh, okay. So anyway, I'm in control now. Okay, let's get moving. Well, it kind of sounded like we're not supposed to be here, dude. Wow, the camera controls are kind of weird. Okay. Let's find this kid. He's been through enough already. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Every time someone mentions the... I can't read that, man. I don't know. We're here to find a kid. Just find him. How many kids could there be out here? Is any of this shit for me? What's this? Uh, buh, buh, buh. Uh, I don't. Yeah, I don't need that. Oh, but I collected it by holding right bumper and choosing them. What? Uh, what a bag. Dog snack. He's a good boy. He can have a snack. What the fuck? What is this? What am I looking at? <laughs> hey, Jess, looking good. It's like she hasn't aged a day since then. What the fuck is happening? I can't even look around. Leather wallet. Dog snack. Dog snack. Wallet. Left bumper. He's a good boy. He's a good boy. Give it to him. Give him the snack. Yeah, good boy. There you go. This game's a little glitchy. That's a good boy. Okay. Um, uh, is there any other cool shit to find? What's that? Is that money? What the fuck? What did I get an achievement for? First psychiatric note. Doesn't look like a. Doesn't look like a psychiatric note. It looks like a fucking child's drawing. Is the child the psychiatric? Because I'm pretty sure that's like. I think you need a doctorate for that. Anyway. Oh, it looks like they have the whole forest covered. So then why are we here? Confidential. Well, they just left it out for people to read. Uh, disappearance. Peter's last seen headed to a friend's house. Peter's a history of running away. No eyewitnesses. Uh, didn't find him on the first search. Oh. Uh, previous escapes. Why would you? Why would you phrase it like that? They make it sound like he's like, like he's in prison and he got away. Okay, wait, hang on. Uh, I'm learning how to manipulate objects. It looks like I can just flip it left and right. I can't flip it up and down. What? <laughs> Jeez. They came well prepared. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if I'm being boring by looking around here. I, I really want to get the good ending. Uh, what is this? It's a, it's a fucking stick, dude. Like, you're gonna see lots of them out here. Oh, what do you got you there? Buddy? What do you got? Give me that. Hey, bullet. Give me that. Yeah, I, I see you. Leaving that laying around, right, boy? Oh, bullet's concerned about the environment. Smokey the Bears taught you well. All right, let's go. Come on, bullet. Better not rush into this. We need to find a way to contact the search party. Okay, so even though I spent a lot of time looking around, I uh, I still miss them. I think it's a radio. But where did they leave it? Is it there? No. Is it in the coffee mug? Probably not. Is it in the back of this truck? Maybe. Oh, I climb up. Okay, so all I can do is like lower this dude's fucking the back of his truck like a dick. No, you know what? We're leaving it down. That might get me the bad ending, but you know what? I don't give a shit. I'm a bad boy like that. What are you doing? Can't take my eyes off you for a second. I'm pretty sure it's a radio, but where the fuck is it? Starting to get annoying. God, I really don't want to start cutting content on the first episode. Like, how many hoods of trucks are there? Okay, where's that note? 
that they left me. Where it's like, oh, we went on ahead because you slept in. Whoa. Uh, I don't think we should be going Sorry, through the Nathan. back of cop trucks. First come, first served. Yeah, I'll call landing once I'm in the forest. Okay. Well, I found it, so I guess I'm going to have to cut content. I managed to stay talking most of that time. Feeling talkative today. Makes this job easy. Good boy, bullet. Good boy. Alright, what do we got here? Open that shit up. Broke ass Come fence. On, Let's go find this kid. Come on, bullet. You don't even need me here. You can go get him yourself. Look at me, basic white guy. Big surprise. I wanna pick I wanna pick the ethnicity of my character. So I can just be this big awesome black guy. Like, if some shit went down, I could be like, oh, hell no, and fucking run. That'd be awesome. Well, what are the odds of the forest doing that? I think pretty low. I sense a more human hand in this, or possibly even something more sinister. Okay, pause, because I feel like that is a great first episode on this so next time on pride plays we're gonna get started looking for that boy and when i say we i mean probably bullet because we're a stupid human with our stupid incompetent noses but that's okay so next time on pride plays thank you guys for tuning in we'll see you next time